Okay, a little something about today's video. I um, I was in Silver Spring picking up the grandkids. Ace was here by himself and he had the music cranked on White Stripes Radio from Pandora, which was excellent music. It would have been a great backdrop to all this work that he did while I was gone. But YouTube doesn't like me using that kind of music. They, they get copyright copyright laws and everybody gets a little bent out of shape. So the audio is a little funky during the uh, talking parts. Uh, so sorry, did the best we could. <laughs> okay, thanks. Okay, we're uncovering these cushions. We need to cut them back a little bit so they fit better for the, um, the lounging pit. And it's time to remake these covers too. They're nice covers, just I think a little different fabric would be good for us. And when uncovering the first one, we came across this. It's a upholstered cushion. So, that's very interesting. Kind of a purplish type hue. So I wonder what's under that. Hopefully foam. Yep, foam. Old, old, old foam. We have said in the past that uh, boat life is moving five things to get to the one thing that you want. And projects are exactly the same thing. When Ace gets in the middle of a project, uh, there are so many rabbit holes he could go down. Mostly it re, uh, is in regards to wiring, something that he wants to follow a wire and find out where it goes and what it does. And uh, most of the time he doesn't. But once in a while, he does go down that rabbit hole, and we're always better for it when he does. But that's why projects take so long. Snap all coated together. I'm going to put my snaps in to hold those cushions in place. Let's pull that screw out of there, then. And get it. But before I do that, I'm going to remove the antenna wire that we don't need right now. Still chasing wires, Ace puts the cutting board that he uh, cut to fit perfectly over our stove. He makes sure the stove isn't gimbaled before he climbs on it to find the rest of that antenna wire that he wanted to remove. With both feet off the ground now, Ace's full weight is on top of that stove. Had he not fixed the gimbaling device on the stove last summer, this could have ended very badly.
think it's a very sharp knife, holding butt knife. Okay. All right. The finish to our cushion resizing project. We didn't re um, cover them. Nope. You took down the cushions to the size that would fit the area. And then we had a slippage problem. You want to talk about it and what you did? Yeah. As you can see, we needed a place for the dog to lay. <laughs> with this, us. This is, this is Blue's place right here. <laughs> no, she lays with dice. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right, so Perfect. this cushion kept sliding out because there's nothing to hold it in place. Um, everything else has things to hold it in place. These have little tabs with snaps. That one and that one. This one has the mask mm -hmm. here to hold it in place, but this one just kept sliding out. So, what we did was we made some velcro straps and attached them onto the cushion one there one there and then we attached it onto the settee here with staples. And then I stitched the other side of the velcro there so that's attached and it can all be removed if we ever want to. And then these are attached here. That. And now I can't pull out. It's stuck. And we can still get into the settee storage. Yeah. Which is underneath, right? We have underneath drawers. Or uh, storage? storage right here. Yeah, right. You can still open it. Oh, look at all that space. Oh, there's lots of space under there. Will it hold, ha, handle a six foot hose? Uh, I don't know. I think maybe. Okay. What's that? Oh, that's. That bag needs a little work, but that's, that's our band instruments for the children. <gasps> band instruments? It's not just for children. Yeah. Come on. It's not, the Osborne Family Band. You know, for adults. <laughs> Okay, and then, yeah, this is all going on. And, and you stapled all that, too. We had got all that recorded. 
It's just unbelievable. We're going on like three months and it has not moved one inch. Unbelievable. Velcro's good stuff. Thank you, honey. It was ingenious. It was just ingenious. And this is also our grandson's bed when he's here. Yeah, he sleeps here. She sleeps over here. Yeah. And then all of us, this is where we all watch TV. Yeah, I mean, we all load into this area and watch TV. It's huge. Yeah. And in the evenings, you, me, and the dog lounge around over here. Every night. And watch TV. And mm -hmm. uh, do they still call it TV? We watch streaming services. Yeah. <laughs> We watch other sailors on YouTube. <laughs> Rarely do. I mean, we have a TV antenna. We get a few channels. Yeah, we get PBS. That's about it. Yeah. TV. Right. It's crazy. Yeah, we'll have to see how much of that we use. But okay, well, thanks so much for your work, honey. It was ingenious, and it's working. Three months, and it has not moved a skidge. There okay. You go. Thanks, honey. Say bye, Ace. Bye, Ace. Okay, today is, I had to go look at my computer, August 20th, 2024. Is that not amazing work? I'm not kidding. This guy just sees something and figures out how to make it better. It's just astounding. I know, I am the luckiest sailing girl on the planet. I know, I really believe that. Plus, I still have a huge crush on him, so that works. This week we spent getting our vaccinations and I think COVID's not going to be ready for another month so we're going to have to get that someplace else on the east coast we'll just pull in somewheres and ask, ask directions <laughs> that's from Captain Ron super funny if you're a fan and so yeah so we've been in DC seeing our doc getting prescriptions for seven months my doctor is so cool she um, actually wrote it for a year now I just have to figure out you know how much I can get filled at one time those things that will be the rest of this week. We are also finalizing our contract to handle our mail while we're gone. Um, that is with the UPS store. We are also, you know, finishing up little details here and there. Right now, Ace is on his bike, on his Harley, headed to Deal. That's a town in Maryland on the Chesapeake Bay. Deal Hardware to get paint to uh, mark our anchor road. Road is chain and line that makes up the anchor road. That's the only name for it. Um, but I think we don't even have line. I think we have all stainless steel chain. So Ace is pretty excited, but he wants to get it flagged for how many feet because he doesn't like anything lower than a five to one scope when we anchor out. And so he'll be painting that. I've got so much to share. I want to get a couple of videos in the bank because <clears throat> once we take off, I don't know what my connections will be like and uploading and that kind of thing. And I would like to have a few saved and ready to publish so that I don't have to, you know, worry about finding a coffee shop and Wi-Fi and jumping in a dinghy with my computer. I'm not really excited about doing that. But um, that it may come to that. I mean, when we watch other YouTube sailing channels, that's what they do. But hopefully with Starlink and our uh, 5G going down the East Coast uh, till December 1st, I think we'll be good. Just in case. I think I'm going to have a few in the bank there. Uh, if we don't respond right away to your comments, thank you, by the way, for leaving comments. We love to interact with you and, and, uh, and hear from you. Um, but if we don't interact right away after we leave, you'll know we're just probably looking for Wi-Fi. <laughs> so, yikes. It'll be interesting. I'm very excited. Every every detail, every time we start talking about it, you know, our minds just Im immediately go to lists and, and stuff. But anyway, I've got, I'm at three minutes. I got to go. Okay. Thanks for following our journey, and you'll see you next time. Cheers.